have started this baby quilt and I'm using some leftover string blocks and I started to put them together in two patches and then four patches. Now I'm going to sew this together. Hi, it's Denny again. Welcome back. I am working on a baby blanket and I've already used my orphan blocks and this yellow dot and I made a baby blanket it's just a small one and I have some flannel I want to use for the backing that cute little cats but the problem is it is kind of see-through especially the yellow dot see how see-through that is even though it was quality Quilting cotton, not the big store kind of place, you know what I mean? <laughs> okay, so what I had thought, since it's already hot here in the south, that I would just make it with the front and the back, the flannel. Well, it's going to be too see-through. I don't like that. So I'm thinking I'm just going to have to go ahead and put some batting in here. And I don't know, would cotton or polyester be better? I don't know. I guess I can see what I have. The thing is, I don't have anything good for the binding to go with this. Most of the scraps from the blocks I had made quite a while ago are on my crumb strips. And I had thought I was going to use these with this baby blanket, but it just doesn't look right. Even though I used the last of my dot to go around the two sides, make it a little wider. So I think I'm going to have to either do pillowcase method or cut my flannel big and make that the binding. Can you make binding with flannel? Let's see. I don't think I did with my flannel quilt. I don't think so. Anyway, okay, so that's where I am. I'm a little stuck right now. I'm going to have to think about this. All right. We'll see what happens. Well, I'm back. I decided to go with the pillowcase method, but I did put white cotton batting in the middle. Getting ready to press it. There's the back, and I'm glad I did that. I thought about rolling the batting, um, the backing over to the front and making it binding, but I just wasn't real crazy about the two together. That's a lot of yellow, don't you think? <laughs> okay, let me get to pressing. Well, this is a first. Can you see that? It didn't break, it bent while I was quilting. That's scary. Yeah. Okay, guess I gotta get a new needle. Okay, all done. This is before I wash it. I'm gonna go wash it and dry it, and we'll see if it gets nice and crinkly. Stay tuned. The baby quilt is out of the washer and dryer. It looks so cute. I've been checking it for strings, thread. The back is cute. All done, ready for giving. And that was all from some leftover string blocks. Okay, that's it for today. I hope y'all are having a great weekend. It's Memorial Weekend here. Take care. Bye-bye.